More than a million dollars in federal grant money is on the way to one school district here in the Tri-Cities region. Yeah, the Greenville City School District has recently been awarded a 21st Century Community Learning Center grant. News Channel 11's Kristen Gallant found out how the one and a half million dollars over the next five years will be put to use. Josh and Sarah, this is not the first time Greenville City Schools has gotten this grant. They apply every five years. The 21st Century Community Learning Center grant is given to Title I schools to help assist those schools with large concentrations of low-income families, helping those children meet their educational goals. I think the largest benefit is, is to our students who get the help they need and uh, really helps them be successful. The 21st Century Community Learning Center grant helps to improve teaching and learning for students in high poverty schools. It is a competitive grant. Uh, not all grant applications are funded. The grant will help provide academic enrichment opportunities during non-school hours. Our main activities, we have a program uh, before school and after school tutoring that we run. The school's also offering credit recovery programs, summer school, and Greenville Promise. It's uh, about a three-week program where we're focused on, uh, on helping them be successful as they enter high school. Providing transportation to and from these programs. Our drivers come back and deliver those students home once tutoring is completed. So we'll try to remove barriers there. The grant totaling more than $1.5 million over a five-year period will assist with the cost of these programs, helping students like Ashley Adams and Brianna Turner. I'm 13 and going into the ninth. I'm scared, <laughs> very scared to go into high school. I mean, it's harder, and I've got, I've got to work hard to get my grades up. Ashley says that after-school programs have helped her in the past and hopes those programs can help this coming school year. Um, for me, math tutoring probably, because I'm not so good at math. It's harder for my brain to memorize like problems and how to solve them, because there's so many. Brianna says she needs help in English and language arts. Uh, because I have ADHD, ADD, um, and my mind likes to add words to things. She says that programs like these help her stay ahead. I actually really enjoyed it. It's like some after school activity that you can get help with homework and if you need help. These after school programs are no cost to students. Five out of six of Greenville City schools are considered Title I schools. In the newsroom, Kristen Gallant, News Channel 11.